What's up, Forts for Beginner Family? Okay, so today we're setting up a demo account. So what we need a demo account is because when we're first learning, we want to trade with uh, not real money. We don't want to be using our own money while we're learning. So we're going to be creating a demo account. So that's what we need as a new student. We're going to start on demo account. Okay, so you want to come over here to accounts, click on my accounts. Uh, right here, it shows that we have zero accounts right now. So, so you want to click on create account. And then right here, where it says create an account, you want to select uh, Google's Wait demo account. So select the demo account, select leverage. Uh, leverage, I'm going to speak more about later, but basically for every dollar we put in our trading account, the, the broker will lend us 500 times our initial investment. So. Uh, why they do that is so we don't need to invest uh, very much money in order to make a lot of money in Forex. So uh, don't worry about this too much right now, but basically the higher the leverage, the better means we, when we go live, we need less money to start. So that's good. So just select the highest leverage, 500. And then for this part right here is the, what size of a dollar amount uh, to be won our demo account. I suggest starting with say 500. Uh, you can, when we go live, you can start with say 250, $250 dollars in your account. But for our demo account, we're just gonna pretend like it's a real account. And what we're gonna do is that's why uh, I'm gonna show you later on Trading View is the, the software you use to mark up the charts. What we do as traders, we mark up charts and we place a trade, either a buy or a sell, and that all starts with. Uh, our, our broker account. That's where we place the trade. So, okay, so back to this. We're creating a demo account. So, create an account, Google's Way demo account. Uh, our leverage is 500 and we want $500 deposited into our demo account. And we hit create account. Right below here it says your demo account was created. Check your email. So, uh, we're going to go to our email. Uh, one second here. Okay. Uh, yeah. Okay. So this is the email that we got from uh, Hugo's way. Uh, it says that our trading account was created. Uh, I want you to save this information. Either you can save this email in a safe spot, or uh, jot this down, or copy and paste it into a Word file. Uh, whatever you want to do, uh, you can just keep this email safe. Um, so this is the information we need. This is going to be our, our our demo account number right there, our password for our account, and then this here investor's password. This is uh, if you, later once you're uh, really good at trading, you can actually give this password out to possible uh, possible investors to view your account, so they only have read-only access to your account. Uh, anyways. More on that later. Right now, so we have our demo account information. So um, in the next video, we're going we're going to download MetaTrader Four. That's where we actually place the trades. Um, you can also download this on your phone, uh, but we we place trades on a computer, um, and then on our phones we monitor it. And we can close out the trade on our phone. It's nice and convenient. Uh, but for analysis, uh, for analysis and opening and closing trades and setting stop loss and take profits, that's all gonna be done on MetaTrader 4. And that's this right here, but I'm gonna show you more on this later. But this is MetaTrader 4. But right now, all you need to do is make sure you jot down this information or keep this information safe. Uh, we now have our demo account created and just click on login. Okay, see you in the next video.